Hi there, welcome to Stop Gaps Home Practice. In this session, you'll get to see a Sule from the Enormous Room. My name is Hannah and I'm a dance artist in Stop Gap Dance Company. I am a white, short, learning disabled standing dancer, got short blonde hair, blue eyes and I'm wearing a grey jumper with black font in the centre with dark blue patterned joggers. So Christian already delivered a solo from the same piece, and this time we'll get to see an insight into my own solo, which I will talk you through much later on. So, let's get warm. So, we're going to start off with our focus, and we're going to look one side to the other. Good. We're going to say a no with our head. Okay, I'm going to do this a couple of times. Saying a no with our head side to side. Okay. Drawing or saying a no. And five, six, seven, and eight. Now we're going to find a circle, drawing a plate with your nose. Good. Take it slow. Drawing a plate with your nose. Good. And five, six, seven, eight. And we're going to find a twist. You're going to twist from one side to the other. You can use your eyes to help you twist. Good. And side to side, finding a twist. Good. Let's include the arm. So we're going to find or imagine a watch on your wrist, showing it to the screen. Side to side, showing your watch to is the screen. Good. Let's do this wide. So find the wide stance. And side. Side. Good. If you're finding the string or watch, you're doing this right. Good. And five. Six, seven, eight. Gonna find a press. We're gonna open up into butterfly arms and making a curve. Butterfly arms, finding a curve. Good. Find butterfly arms, finding a curve. Good. Look, you're pressing it down to the floor. Good. Uh, do this a couple of times. Good. If you're finding a bit of with wings and you're finding your curve, you're doing this right. Good. A few more times like this. Five, six, seven, eight. Good. Let's do it on the other side. You're going to find a thing, a nose with your nose. Side to side. Good. If you're saying a name with me, you're doing this way. Five, six, seven, eight. And finding a circle. Drawing a plate with your nose. 
Good. Drawing a plate with your nail. Five, six, seven, eight. Good. And twist. The twist from one side to the other. Let's take it up at speed. And twisting side to side. Use your eyes to help you. Let's bring the arms in. Good. Finding your watch towards the screen. Good. If you're finding your watch towards the screen, you're sticking with me. Good. Five, six, seven, eight. And we find the play arm and making a cut. Good. And put fly arms and finding a curve with a press. Good. A few more times like this. If you're finding your foot fly wings, finding that curve, you're doing this right. Good. And five, six, seven, eight. Good. And one last time, side to side. Hang a nose with your nose. Good. Good. Five, six, seven, eight. And circle. Drawing a plate with your nose. Five, six, seven, eight. And twist. Twist. Finding that twist side to side. Good. Use your eyes to help you to um, twist and watch to the screen. Watch to the screen. If you're doing this right, sewing the wrist, that is correct. Good. And five, six, seven, eight. You can do this right if you wanted to. And five. Six, seven, and eight. And press for the last time. Finding our butterfly arms and pressing down, making a curve. And <sighs> good. Finding the butterfly arms, finding a curve in your back and your arms. Good. If you're doing the butterfly arms nice and wide, I'm finding that curve, you're doing this right with me. Good, a few more times like this. And five, six, seven, eight. Good, and let's find a spot. Okay, finding a sprint, a jog. Good, you're doing this right. Keep up. Stick with me, stick with me. Good, nice. And speed it up, speed it up, and slowly down, good, nice, great, I hope you're feeling nice and warm, so let's get uh, a water break in, so let's get your water. Now that you're on your water break, I'm just going to talk you through what my solo is about. So, my solo is featured in the piece, The Enormous Room. The Enormous Room is about a father-daughter relationship who lost a loved one in the piece so dearly to them. I'm dedicating the solo to David Toole as he played my father in the piece. My solo, at times, is slow, but there are parts where there are quick, sudden parts. I will show my CLA for audio description and translation prep. Facing the corner in an upright position, one arm above the head in a diamond shape. Wrist pulls sideways to circle around the body. Hannah guides the leg to circle to the back, facing square in a lunge. 
bent arm snaps above Hannah's head, while the other gently places on the wrist. Pulling arms to the back, quick turn, finishing forwards with an arm extended long. Rebounding the elbow back and resting on the thighs. Both arms open like a book sideways. One arm reaches over the head into a curve. Two arms swipe back, hands flick up, collapses down. Hannah's head is heavy. She recovers. If you're translating, you can use my spine and eye line as your focus to help you. So let's get moving. <coughs> So my first move starts slightly off the corner and I got my arm above my head um, shaped in a half triangle. My first move is going to start off with a twist. So my dominant side is going to find a twist as I melt the other. Yeah. And when I do that, I imagine a watch on my wrist. Yeah. So finding my triangle with my arm. We find the watch facing towards the back corner as I melt the other. I trace it down to the inside knee. From here, I engage my centre and I lift my leg around into a lunge, a twisted lunge. From the top again. We find our arm above the head. We twist as we show our watch to the back corner as I melt the other. I trace it down towards my inside knee. I lift to find my lunge. For translation, same thing with the arms at the, at the beginning. I um, twist as I map the other. From here, uh, um, as we trace, we're going to find that, um, that find that resistance in your arm to find your back bar. Yeah? Uh, I'll do that with you. So we go up to find the back bar, yeah? Let's do that with music. Finding your arm above your head. And we twist, showing your watch to the back corner and see your out. We draw or trace it down to the inside knee, finding that resistance in the arm to find your back bar. Good. From here, I'm going to find a slam with your other side. <laughs> with, good. From here, we're going to find a slow reach in the place of the other side. Yep. Yeah. We're going to pull that same arm towards the back space as I show my ribs towards the screen as I reach away. Here. From here, we're going to find a turn or a head roll if you're translating to find a reach in the arm. Good. From that bit again, so um, finding our lunge. Good. We slam. Good. A reach towards the other side. We show our ribs to the screen. Yeah, we turn or a head roll to find your reached arm. Let's do that from the top with music. Finding a triangle. Good. And we twist it, we melt the other side. We trace it down to the knee. We lift, finding that resistance to find the back bar. We slam. Good. We reach up and place. We show 
of our ribs to the screen as we reach the right. Raise your hand from the elbow or a head roll to find your reach arm. From here, we're going to find a bend in the arm as we unfold it to the back space. We stick it in to the lap. From here, we're going to find our butterfly arms, butterfly wings, as the weight transference. From here, we're going to find making a shell, making a curve with one arm, and your ankle is off the floor. From here, we're going to find our Dave tall wide hands, and we're going to find a half circle with these arms. Yeah? Let, let's do that from the uh, reach of the arm. So, we bend in the arm as we unfold. We stick it in. We find our butterfly arms nice and wide. We're making a shell. Find our Dave tool hands. From here, I'm going to stick a match with my other side as I flick some water off my fingertips. From here, we're going to find and collapse down to the floor with soft knees, or you can collapse towards your lap. And then we recover. Okay, so let's do it one more time from the very top with music. Finding a triangle. Good. And showing your watch to the back space as we melt. Tracing it down to the knee. We push, finding your back bar. We slam. Slowly reach to us. Okay, we show our ribs to the screen. We turn our head rolled to find a reach in the arm. We find a bend in the arm. To the back. We stick it in, finding our butterfly arms, finding a curve in one arm with the ankle up, white hands to the back, flick, and then we collapse and recover. Good. So please put in practice each time. My advice to you is for you to use my CLA to find your own tempo that suits you. You can use this ghost-like music to find your quality of loss. Um, we will do this a few more times without me speaking this time with music. Finding a triangle. One last time, finding the triangle. Thank you for joining me. I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did. 
and please like, comment, share and subscribe to our channel. Thank you very much. I will see you soon.